This is Tajima's Ultra Thin Chalk Write Jam Free. Tajima is renowned for manufacturing top of the line chalk boxes, offering an array of styles, each with its own set of uses and features. A favorite amongst this selection is the Chalk Write Jam Free, which boasts an ABS body, a one millimeter bold line, and a more economical price point than other chalk boxes in the lineup. The highly visible line snapped by this box makes it ideal for framers, roofers, drywallers, or any professional in need of a clean, easy to see marking. But what about those looking for something a bit more precise? Enter the Chalkrite Jam Free Ultra Thin. This box was designed for the finished carpenter, for those projects where a sixteenth of an inch matters. In this video, I'm going to show you what makes a Tajima chalk box worth the price tag, how to use it, and what makes this box superior when it comes to finish work. The Chalkrite Jam Free features a translucent ABS body with shock absorbing rubber grip. The blue body of the Ultra Thin distinguishes it from the black body of the Bold Line model. What's nice about the translucent body is it allows you to see how much chalk you have in the box. Not only will this let you know when it's time for a refill, but it will also help prevent overfilling, which is one of the most common reasons your string will bind up. When it comes to refilling, the Jam Free features a large opening, making it easy to add chalk. The cap is equipped with an O-ring to keep the chalk in and the water out, as well as a replaceable felt to brush off any excess chalk before you snap your mark. Now you might be saying to yourself, that line is so thin, it'll probably snap on my first snap. Well, let me quell those worries. The braided line is extremely strong, so if it's regularly breaking, you may want to refine your technique. Now, after plenty of use, eventually, your line may break. And what a pain it can be to retrieve that line from inside the box. Well, don't worry. Tajima's got you covered. Little known secret about Tajima shock boxes, they feature a hidden retrieval tool. This tool allows you to reach inside the box, hook your line, and pull it out without any fuss. The Chalkrite series of boxes spools out smoothly and retracts quickly with its 5 to 1 geared winding handle. Now, a quick note on winding. We've already talked about how overfilling can cause binding, while well, another primary cause is winding too tight. So remember, to avoid overtensioning, always disconnect your end hook before retrieving. So now that we've shed some light on the superior design quality of the Jam Free Ultra Thin, let's check out how to use it and how that snap line compares to the Jam Free Bold and the Irwin Classic Chalk Reel. The Tajima end hook can be attached to the edge of the material or using a nail or a screw. Notice the rubber coating. It protects by materials that could be prone to scratching. A small detail some finished carpenters might appreciate. The tension should be taut, but this isn't a tricep workout. Reach out two to three feet, pull up the line a few inches, and release. As you can see, the Ultra Thin snaps an incredibly clean and precise line. This precision is why finished carpenters love it. When margin for error is thin, better reach for a chalk line to match. The bold is also very clean and highly visible. The old classic here does the job, but you be the judge. Tajima has developed quite a cult following. With their attention to detail and exceptional build quality, they make tools you not only need, but want to use. So what do you think? Is Tajima worth the premium price tag, or is the Irwin box more your speed? You guys are the pros, so let us know what you think in the comments below. Until next time, keep working and take care.